Now, meteorologist Jamie Jarosik and your Storm Team 2 forecast. We're starting the day with dry conditions. Yesterday we had flurries throughout much of the day, just some light snow accumulation. But today we don't have to worry about that. We're starting at 20, though. It's colder than it was yesterday morning. This afternoon, with the sun, actually gets a little bit warmer. Yesterday's high was 32. Today we'll push into the mid 30s. Still dry even late this afternoon, but we expect some snow tonight. Some spots are even in the teens. We have 18 in Eaton and Greenville, 18 degrees up in Wapakoneta. It's 19 now in Springfield. And high pressure is in control of our weather, but we will occasionally see some high clouds drifting in today. Thin enough that we'll see sun through those high clouds. There's our next area of low pressure that will continue to lift up our way. Lots of moisture surging in with this. And as it hits some colder air, we have some snow breaking out. That will continue to lift our way too. Certainly cold enough for snow initially in the Miami Valley, but we expect many different types of precipitation over the next 24 hours. The snow that will develop first is expected to accumulate. Maybe an inch or two from Cincinnati into southern Butler, Warren, and Clinton counties. We get two to three inches, Richmond, Eaton, Dayton, Xenia. And then across the north, there's the potential for slightly higher amounts with a later changeover occurring. But that's the key. We are going to see a changeover where we get sleet mixed in, some freezing rain, and then eventually all rain. So those totals will be short lived. If you're up early, you'll see them. If you sleep in a little bit, we'll already have that changeover and it will be melting. So tonight is when it gets snowy. That'll happen after 11 o'clock or midnight. Roads really deteriorate tonight. Tomorrow morning with a mix falling, we're expecting the snow that has fallen overnight to be on the ground becoming slushy as that mix develops. And then in the afternoon tomorrow, really just wet conditions. We'll have tons of puddles around from the melting and the additional rainfall. And we could have some heavier precipitation at times. So we do have a winter weather advisory for all of the area from midnight tonight till noon Wednesday because we are going to have impacted travel from this. It's going to get messy tonight and stay that way at least through the first half of the Wednesday morning drive. Future track today, though, shows no problems weather-wise. Dry through lunchtime. A bit of an increase in cloud cover across the southern Miami Valley towards 5 o'clock, and then everyone will see clouds thicken tonight ahead of the system. Here comes the snow, 3 a.m., falling heavy in spots, and that mixed precipitation in our southern counties. All of that will continue to lift north. As we head through 6 a.m., Dayton will just be coming out of that mix, and across the far north, you'll be getting into it. Then everybody changes over to rain through 8 a.m., so the afternoon looks just wet with occasional showers moving through and some heavier downpours possible. Today we're up to 36, a partly to mostly sunny, chilly but dry day. Overnight we'll drop to 29. We expect snow to develop, accumulate 2 to 3 inches, and then mix with some sleet and even freezing rain late. And it'll be a wintry mix early tomorrow morning, changing to rain by mid-morning. So again, 8 o'clock, we're all rain. We'll see highs tomorrow up to 45. It's going to be a little breezy. Dry Thursday, 44. On Friday, 48. And then over the weekend, we have 50s in the forecast, but also the chance for rain both Saturday and Sunday.